excuse me, and the raspberry raptured. We're going to get a, a taste test and a hydrometer reading. First thing we're going to do is pull out the, the bubbler so we don't get a back suck, suck back, whatever you want to call it. You don't need that in your beer. And keep that out of the way. I got my uh, hydrometer into the thing. Everything's sanitized here. Probably see some chunks come out of here. Take it out slowly. A lot of puree, a lot of puree coming out. A lot of puree. All right, we're going to get this up here. And we'll let it sit a minute. Sit a minute. <laughs> and if it looks like we're close enough in the range here, well, it looks like we're going to be, uh, oh man, my back hurts. Ten. I don't know. Always comes out sweet. We'll get back to you on that, but we're going to the keg. It's been uh, 15 days. All right, the raspberry raptured. We made a raspberry rapture and a raspberry raptured. This is the raptured. It doesn't uh, make a difference, but they're the same. Uh, we come in at 1.052 minus our finishing gravity was 1.0. One zero and times one thirty one point two five equals gives us an alcohol content of five point five one two five. So we'll write that down five point five one. I guess that's five point two five, but it's five point five one. So we're going to go to the kegging. You got the kegging, the sanitizer right here. We wash it out with a cleaner, and then we, we put the sanitizer in there. We let it sit for a few minutes. We'll dump that out. We'll uh, our transfer hoses in here, sanitizing yet. Our cover, our cap, everything in there that we need. And we'll probably spray the, spray the fitting down here again for shits and giggles, but I like to keep it clean. So off the keg in here in a few minutes. Oh, actually... We better get a taste test on this. This is really thick with puree. So, this is going to taste pretty strong. <laughs> the puree sit at the bottom of the kettle. Oh, the smell. Definitely a raspberry smell. Just what I expected. Made it enough, so off to the keg. On. Get your bubbler out of there. Don't forget that. You don't want the back sucked during the trap. The, the transfer. You got a lot of uh, trub out of this one, but that's okay. She'll clear up out of the keg at the bottom later on when the cold crashes. Uh, this keg has an actual bubble of uh, sanitizer separating that from the air. <laughs> that works out pretty good in here. So yeah, the raspberry raptured is being transferred and it's going to be in our belly about a, I don't know, depends how I, how I go. I still got the, I still got the uh, one my daughter had me made there. And I never remember the name of my own freaking beers here. It was the, uh, the Velvet Crush of Bloody Summer. That's still in the kegerator. We're enjoying that as the summer <sighs> things along. It's just moving along very slowly here. Cloudy days every day, rain every day. Mm. Wow, it's gonna be a good beer. And once again, here comes the snake of loveliness. <laughs> I love seeing this. It's just about empty. Picking up a little bit more trub, 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 whatever you want to call it. Just about empty. Here she goes. She picked up a little piece of yeast. Getting a full keg out of this. This will be superb oriental beer. <laughs> and here comes some more puree. I think we'll shut her down. Crushed velvet, bloody summer. 
is in the kegerator there on tap. And we're putting a, a raptured raspberry in now. Getting rid of the seal or the air space, a little bit of air space. Plenty. That's done. Shut off our yellow line. Turn on our red line. Ooh, I'm sorry. Turn on our white line. It's going to be the delivery. Looks like it was on all this time. I don't like that, but I'm going to rock this keg into place and uh, I'll be drinking this shortly. Check for leaks first. I don't see any. Uh, and have the in face in the back. There's good. I see my valve this time, so got that on. And we're gonna shut the yellow one off because I don't need that now. The yellow's off. White and red are on. Oh shit! What was that? <clears throat> Crammed it. Uh, jam crammed it, but there we go Now we got a brew again next brew is another blood orange go figure My daughter designed that Don't look too bad for a, a little logo. We might be using in the future <laughs> 